If you watch any of our previous gaming videos regarding Samsung phones or even tablets for that matter, you will see this little widget on the screen. And within this little widget, we can see the FPS, the CPU and GPU utilization and also the temperature. So today I'm going to teach you how to enable it and it is actually quite simple yet applicable to every single Samsung smartphone and tablets out there right now. So what you gotta do is to use the Samsung game launcher and then from there just launch any games that you can find or you have on your phone. And then open the notification bar and then you will see a special little game icon right there. Tap on that and then on the top right corner of that little widget there right beside the gear settings menu button you can see there's a little jigsaw puzzle piece with a down arrow. Tap on that and then you head into a menu inside the Galaxy Store itself to download something called the game plugins and then what you gotta do is to download and install the game plugins or in our case here I don't know why it says update so just update it and then once the installation is done press open and then you will be greeted with a menu that says welcome to game plugins I'll skip all of the preamble and head into the main menu itself where there's something called perf z so what you gotta do is to tap into perf z and then you will be linked into the galaxy store again and now you gotta download the PervZ plugin. And once that's done installing, head back to the games plugin menu and then you can see PervZ can now be enabled. And now with PervZ installed, you can just tap on it to enable it, go through some other permission settings and then finally you can head back into your game and see your CPU utilization, your GPU utilization, your FPS and also your device's temperature. And best of all, this widget is actually quite customizable too. As you can see here, we can configure it to be just a little thin bar graph there to see the utilization or you can even expand it to see a little bit more complete in terms of information or you can change the way it is laid out as well or you can even disable the individual bar graphs according to which one's more important to you or also adjust how it looks and whatnot. Well, you get the idea. It's just really highly customizable. And one more thing is that you can actually tune how it is laid out. So by default, what we have is everything is in one vertical line, but you can also make it in a two by two grid or everything in just one horizontal line. So yeah, it really depends on how you want it to be. And so far, we realized that this thing is just really versatile and it applies to every single game that you have installed on your Samsung tablet or smartphone. So that's it. I think this is a really good widget for you to have on your phone, especially if you are a tech geek like we are and you just want to know every single nook and cranny about your phone. So that's all we have for you today. This is a real quick tip and we'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.